Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the bell icon for latest video updates. Apple's iPhone 14 design changes leaked a month ago, but speculation about their performance has proved much more controversial. And now a new leak has set tongues wagging about their battery life. Shared by a credible industry insider, Shrimp Apple Pro, he has published a new post in which what it claims are the battery capacities for all iPhone 14 models. This is the first time capacities have been reported for the new range, while three models have received minor battery increase, a drop for the iPhone 14 Pro may mean your money is better spent elsewhere. But let me tell you, the post is removed now. This is often seen as a sign of accuracy because the accurate data is more sensible and posters come under significant pressure but it is impossible to know for sure. The leak breaks down the battery capacities as follows. iPhone 14 is expected to have 3279 mAh and iPhone 13 have 3227 mAh. iPhone 14 Max is expected to have 4325 mAh iPhone 14 Pro is expected to have 3200 mAh and iPhone 13 Pro has 3095 mAh. iPhone 14 Pro Max is expected to have 4323 mAh while iPhone 13 Pro Max have 4352 mAh. The big news comes from the big phones. If these numbers are correct, there is every chance that the new iPhone 14 Max will outlast the flagship iPhone 14 Pro Max. An Apple leaker has published a set of information on Apple's upcoming products, including the iPhone 14 lineup, in his latest post. In addition to leaks surrounding a desktop devices like Mac Mini, Mac Pro, iPad Pro models coming this year. Sporting a variety of M2, M2 Pro, M2 Max, M2 Ultra, M2 Extreme chips, a moderate Apple Watch 8 upgrade using the same chipset as the Watch 7, a second generation HomePod, AirPods Pro and much more is expected. Like the Apple Watch, the iPhone 14 Pro will be able to show weather, calendars, stocks, activities and other data while the screen remains at the low brightness and frame rate adding his weight to revealing iOS 16 beta code which hinted at the feature earlier this month. As for the privacy side, there will be a setting for the Apple Watch that keeps sensitive data from appearing on the lock screen for all to see. This would combat one of the big concerns iPhone users have expressed about this feature. Also tech industry leaks by saying that iPhone 14 Pro models will have much improved front facing camera, a new rear camera system that includes 48 megapixel sensor, thinner bezel, a faster A16 chip and redesigned notch with a pill shape cutout for face ID and hole punch for the camera. Well that's a lot to pack in one update. On the other hand, standard models will generate less excitement because the lower end phones will stick with the same A16 chip as the iPhone 13. True, the 5.4 inch mini size will be replaced with the 6.7 inch model. Meanwhile, despite the entry level, iPad switching to USB-C in the fall. And a new report from tech side and supply chain specialist Digitimes claims that components have been finalized for the iPhone 14 range and shipments have been begun. These components will be stockpiled before mass production begins in the next 1-2 months ahead of range traditional September-October release. That's enough for the day and I'll see you in the next video.